Good afternoon, my name is Blake Davis. I'm the brand manager for Monster Meal Feed and Wildlife Attractants. Uh, we're here today to discuss spring mineral needs and spring nutritional needs of white-tailed deer. A lot of people understand that deer need special nutrition in the spring, but they're not really sure why they need it or how to get it into them. In the springtime, one of the things that you can pretty much expect across the country is a lot of water. Uh, what that water does is that warms up the soil and it gets the plants growing. So the plants have a lot of water in them, but they don't have a lot of nutrients. Their primary objective is to grow. Now, it's the first feed that the deer or other wildlife get in the spring, so they can eat a lot of it and they want to eat a lot of it, but they're not getting the maximum nutrition out of it. it this is by nature's design that you don't want to just force feed everything in all at once and change everything all at once but you can maximize things. Here in Iowa, we're having a really, really wet spring, which just exacerbates the problem. How can you help your deer in the spring when what they eat has relatively low nutritional quality? The first thing is mineral. Uh, minerals kind of act just like the vitamins and the minerals that you try to put in your own body. They're the small components that make big differences in a white-tailed deer. You've all heard about salt licks and sodium, and sodium is very important. It's the only ingredient in any mineral that deer will naturally self-regulate. Why do they crave it? They have to keep up their vascular pressure. They're fast animals with a really high metabolism, and that leads to they have to maintain good blood pressure. It's why they seek out sodium. Sodium, as the attractant, gives us a pathway to get all the other micronutrients and minerals into the deer which is really important because if you give them everything they need all year long, you maximize the potential for one, visitation to your own property, number two, the genetic potential or the biological potential of the animal because you're giving them everything that they need. So if we start with mineral licks and we talk about micronutrients and things like that, we're gonna jumpstart their metabolism we're gonna condition that animal to come to the property that we want them to come on. We can take pictures of them, we can hunt them. We can just be a benefit to those deer. That, as a land manager, is probably the most important reason why we feed minerals. Minerals are also important because they make up most of the skeleton. Does use minerals to augment lactation. Bigger fawns mean bigger bucks. And then throughout the year, a buck actually pulls its antler development from its skeletal structure. There's a, there's a chemical process that goes through and it needs the right ratios of minerals. So Monster Meal has gone so far as to create a mineral block and a, and a loose mineral supplement that has the right ratios of calcium, phosphorus, zinc, manganese, all the things that you need. For more information, go to monster-meal.com, animal attraction, premium nutrition, superior results.